Hi, this is Jen Lasser with Adobe Analytics Product Management. In this video, I'm going to introduce you to a new feature that we're calling Percent of Row. So when you're in freeform tables, you'll notice that you'll automatically see percentages whenever you add in different metrics to a table. These percentages have historically been a percent of total column value. So for example, if you look at the other column here and you have 1.2 million, these percentages are saying each row as a percent of that total. But we heard from many of our customers that they wanted the percentages to instead be based on the total of a row. So instead of dividing by 1.2 million, you would look across the row here for this total and divide 346,000 by the row total. This will create significantly different percentages, but sometimes that's exactly what you need. Um, in this use case here, we're looking at the trend of device types for uh, desktop, mobile phone, and tablet by week. And we want to see if the, the volume of mobile phone and tablet is increasing over time. With percentages based on the columns, we can't really get that, um, that takeaway that we need. So we've added to the, the row header here, the gear, the option to calculate the percentages you see, not by column, but instead by row. So when I click that, notice the percentages now are significantly different. They used to be about 25% for each row before. Now we see that desktop or other accounts for about 99% of our traffic, mobile phone 0.9% and tablet 0.2. You'll see the chart that is based on this table also updated. So now we can very easily see the trend of our devices over time and if mobile is growing in usage or not. So hope you guys are excited about this new feature percent of row um, and get a lot of use out of it. 